As many of you know, Meghan Markle's lifestyle blog, The Tig, shut down back in 2017 right before she announced her engagement to Prince Harry. On The Tig, Meghan would often share recipes as well as gushes about food, travel, and lifestyle. One recipe she featured multiple times on the site was for a homemade strawberry jam. At the time, many assumed Meghan had developed the recipe herself through trial and error in the kitchen. However, new information has surfaced that is casting doubt on whether or not Meghan can truly take credit for the jam. According to Corey Vitiello, he and Meghan dated for over two years back in 2013 to 2015 while she was still working on suits in Toronto. During their time together, Corey says he and Megan enjoyed cooking together on weekends at her home. He claims it was during one of these cozy cooking sessions that he showed Megan his family's secret strawberry jam recipe that had been passed down through generations. Corey says Megan was madly in love with how the jam turned out and begged him to share the full recipe with her so she could make it herself in the future. Feeling flattered, Corey obliged and gave Megan a handwritten copy of the exclusive Vidiello strawberry jam recipe. Fast forward a few years to 2016 when the TIG was in full swing. Eager readers would visit Megan's lifestyle blog for the latest in all things Megan finds intriguing. Lo and behold, featured multiple times was a strawberry jam recipe. Only it wasn't credited to Corey or his family. It was plastered on the internet for all to see as Megan's homemade strawberry jam. Corey claims when he first saw the recipe posted, he knew immediately it was his family's treasured Vidiello strawberry jam being passed off as Megan's own creation. Understandably, Corey was furious that his secret generational recipe had been stolen and broadcasted to the world without permission or credit given. However, at the time he decided not to make a fuss, partly because he had mostly moved on from Megan and also didn't want to rock the boat of her newfound celebrity. Fast forward again to 2022 when Megan's fame had reached a fever pitch as a royal. According to reports, the final straw for Corey came when he learned Megan was looking to sell jars of her supposedly homemade strawberry jam online through her Archwell website for $42 a pop. Outraged that his family recipe was being monetized, Corey decided enough was enough. He took to social media and spilled all the dirty details of dating Megan, sharing the jam recipe in confidence, and how hurtful it was that she took full credit without acknowledging his role. Corey also made sure to include photos of the handwritten recipe sheet he had given Megan all those years ago as proof of his claims. The post went viral overnight with intense backlash towards Megan for yet another allegation of stealing another person's work. This latest controversy proved too hot for Megan to ignore. Sources close to her say she was livid that Corey dared speak out against her and threaten the business of her pricey jam sales. That's when Megan took aggressive legal action and allegedly threatened Corey with a lawsuit for defamation and copyright infringement if he did not immediately retract his statements. She claimed full ownership over the strawberry jam recipe and denied ever getting it from him. Fearing a costly legal battle, Corey caved to Megan's pressure and removed his social media posts, essentially silencing him from sharing his story any further. However, the damage was already done. Screenshots and archives of Corey's original accusations exploded all over the internet. What Megan perhaps failed to realize was that the court of public opinion is not so easily silenced or intimidated. Her reputation continued to take major hits with each new controversy. To loyal followers of the TIG and fans of the Royals, it started to seem like a troubling pattern was emerging of Megan taking undeserved credit for others' work. More and more ex-associates and past friends started coming forward with similar stories of feeling betrayed or misrepresented by Meghan.